All right, so welcome to a let's play of Kerbal Space Program. Um, as you can see, if you looked on any previous videos in this channel, uh, we used to have an old Minecraft series that kind of took a slump down a couple months ago, simply because we lost time, we lost track of things, and my internet went to crap. Uh, didn't get much views anyways. Uh, I think the last video might have, might have been the, um, what was it, the 1. Point, no, the 1.9? Uh, 1.8 commercial? I don't remember, when, whenever Jungles came out and Jungle Temples came out or whatever it might have been in Minecraft anyways. So, what better way to start off a Let's Play channel again with one of my personal favorite games uh, and seems to be almost practically half of the internet's favorite game, Kerbal Space Program. I'm sure all of you know what this is if you even searched it because why would you be here anyway? So, let's get started. Um, it's been a while since I played Kerbal Space Program, vanilla anyways, and uh, I've always been using mods, so whoops, that's not it. Uh, <clears throat> in particular, MechJeb, and you know what they say if you use MechJeb, you kind of get rusty at everything else. Uh, let's name this uh, Kerbal the Alliance. I don't know. No, I don't exclamation point. Let's see. So let's start the game. A little nice birds in the background still. Uh, let's get building. I guess we can start building a simple orbital vessel. I'm sure Eric, you've seen Let's Plays hundreds and hundreds of times building an orbital vessel. But this is kind of for my own good. Simply because I don't quite remember how to get into manual orbit. I think I do remember, but more, more so how to get into an orbit without mech jeb. Where are parachutes? Okay, this is the Mark 16 parachute. That's what I need. Uh, the coupler stage? Yes? Oh my gee. <laughs> I'm so used to seeing hundreds of pages of parts all over the place trying to navigate through it, but this seems a lot simpler. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, we're going to need, hmm, what should be, what should be our, I guess, low carbon orbit standard, right? I guess we could make it 100,000 kilometers. Let's, let's try that. All right, let's try to make a service module here. It's small engine. Oh, whoa, 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 okay. Holding down right click trying to rotate the screen didn't work. Uh, that's good for the beginning. Let's get one of those, uh... Where is it? Where is that thing? There you go. Monopropellant tanks. Uh, let's get some symmetry up there. Oh, angle snap. Yep. Uh, get this in there. Let's make it flush against the hull. Uh, many people probably won't like this design, but uh, I use it quite frequently uh, for my space taxi, I guess you can call it, to one of my old space stations. I set up another save file and... Uh, uh, my modded version. Let's see. I need a pair of thrusters. Uh, let's make the yeah, let's make that four thrusters right there. Uh, that's good. And let's throw on a couple lateral or inline uh, solar panels here. Looks good to me. Okay, now that is done. Let's build us. Oh, 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 oh! Actually, you know what? This vessel. I might want it to dock. Okay, so let's let's get a small little Clampatron Jr. And a side-mounted parachute. Whoop, not four. We don't need four. Uh, that's good to me. Whoa. Okay. Freaking out there. <laughs> Mouse not responding or something. Uh, Alright, that's good. Let's build us our orbital injection stage. Take one of those. And one of these. Uh, take one of the non-gimbling engines. Oh, well, mm -hmm. do I want to make this stage gimbal? That's the question. Yeah, yeah, I think that's good. I think that's okay. Let's add a booster, not boosters, uh, a dual engine setup on the side here. 
Oh, Separatrons. One of these separat smaller Separatrons. Let's get to me. Uh-huh. Alright, okay. Don't worry, it's not done yet. It's not gonna look like that. <laughs> uh, uh, so it's in the bottom. It doesn't, doesn't make a difference anyways, does it? Oh, whoa. Okay, I have very nimble fingers, as you can see. Clicking all over the place. <laughs> Clicking outside the window, as a matter of fact. Alright, whoa. Okay, that was strange. It wanted me a, it was going to let me attach it on the inside of that fuel tank. Alright then, let's put some gimbling engines. Uh, let's see some nose cones. Oh, that's right. Oh, crap. Oh, dang it. This is not... <laughs> those nose cones are modded. Alright, I guess we'll use one of these stubby little things. Uh, struts. That's good. Alright. And like that. Looks pretty horrible, actually. Whatever, it gets the job done. Uh, fuel lines. Taking these big tanks into there. Alright. Ah, oh, it's starting to look like a rocket, eh? So. Oh! Dang it! Okay, that's what I'm missing. Okay. <laughs> Advanced SAS. Imagine to launch off into space without computer guidance. <laughs> that would have been catastrophic. Uh, this looks good to me. I'm pretty sure this will get up to 100,000 kilometers. 100,000 kilometers, sorry. 100, 100 kilometers. 100,000 meters, not... 100, what? Yeah. 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 Three decimal places, right? 1,000 meters equals one kilometer. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Um, okay. Add one of these launch towers. Okay, and let's check the staging out here. That's good. Those engine fires with the main. Where's the main engine? There's the main engine. All right, these drop off. That detaches. And then I have the service module engine right there. If you hear that hissing in the background, it's because I live in an apartment and the heater unit has went on. Fantastic. Huh. I really should have recorded earlier. I was being very hesitant about this simply because I had to set up a new hard drive to record to, simply because I really don't want to have Fraps give me a 10 gigabyte file on my main my main hard drive. Okay, I think this looks good. Let's give it a title and a little name here. Um, the Explore, oh, Explorer Mark 1. Uh, yeah, and let's just do this. So I know which one is manned and not manned. I just like to do that, don't ask me why. Uh, save it, and let's launch. So yeah, like I said earlier, it's been a long time since I did a manual liftoff, but uh, I don't think anything has changed. What has happened here? Could not switch to requested monitor resolution. Okay, welcome back. Um, apparently I had some issues with uh, a program called Resizer, uh, which I use for resizing my window, so I record in 720p. But apparently, it wanted to foul up and didn't let me adjust resolution. So, and I figured out that KSP natively has a 720p resolution uh, window selector option and the graphic settings. So, <laughs> let's just get back into it. Where were we? Okay. Explorer Mark 1, manned. Let's load. Okay. Hopefully it doesn't crash again. Let me see if I'm actually recording. I am actually recording, that's good. Oh, oh. Okay, good old Jeb. Uh, check everything out. Look at the staging. All looks good to me. Hopefully this rocket works. Doubt it will. Let's see. SES on. All right. Lift off in five, four, three, two, one. Okay, let's go. Whoa, okay, that's loud. On my end, anyways. Alright. Heading off to a 100 kilometer orbit. Uh, is that leaning inward or is it just me? I have no idea. I, 
I, I'm pretty sure it'll work. Jeb looks absolutely happy. Or, <laughs> well, as happy as Jeb would be. If we're crashing, he would be happy anyway, so... Better to get a second opinion from Bob and Bill. Maybe that should be our next mission after this one. Get a three-person ship into orbit. And then, I guess we can start on a space station. A very simple space station. And go to the moon. I am counting my chickens before they hatch. Okay. Um, yeah, that's not good. I, I don't even know if we get into orbit yet. And I don't think so. Is that the fuel? No, that's the main fuel. Okay, this these are draining out. That, oh, that one's draining already. Oh yeah, that's going to zoom first. Okay, stage seven. Now, let's begin a gravity turn. What are we? Alright, I think this is a good height to do that. Oh, rolling, rolling. Oh, roll the wrong way. Okay, SAS on. There we go. Okay, let's correct this as much as possible. I'll let SAS figure that out. Let's look on the map. How high are we? 25,000 meters. 25 kilometers. We are not going to make what we want, are we? Okay, let's try to actually pitch back up, why don't we? A little bit. Okay, that looks good to me. Alright. Now it's a waiting game. Should be accelerating more there. 37,000 kilometers. You know what? We might make it. Uh, on second thought, perhaps not. Bleeding to that. Oh, come on, bring it up there. Just give me, I don't know, a, a 60,000 kilometer then. Or something. Should be accelerating a little more now. 60,000. Okay. Good. 75, 77. 80. Oh man, oh boy, we're getting there. Getting there, and shut down. Okay. Good thing I remember how to shut down the engines. It was. Yeah, it was X. Okay. Huh. Alright. So, how much fuel do we have left? That doesn't look pleasing to me. Um, me. Uh, yeah, yeah. That, that's good. That, that's that's pretty good. Okay. Get one of these maneuver nodes here. Whew, it's been a while since I fooled around with this. A little bit of prograde. Why don't we? Might as well use this. 145, 92. Okay, that's not what I want. 120. What? Huh? What? What? Okay. 70, 23, okay. 103, oh, can't see that it's in the climate, 98, just smidge a little bit, oh, oh, oh. 98, 103, I just flipped it around in a circle, okay, ah, that works, pretty sure that'll work, let's get on that node there, pitch slowly, oh man, I forgot how much of an elephant these kind of crafts are okay don't miss that all right just line us in and that looks good to me now how far are we we are 56 seconds away let's warp a little bit 40 do an early burn say five seconds okay so miss that five seconds Might not have enough fuel. Let's keep an eye on that and let, let's keep on our delta V bar there. Estimated burn 30 seconds. Ooh, might just shave it right to the hair. No. Oh boy. Coming on in. Oh, come on, baby. Come on. I really don't want to use the service module stage for this. I just want to use it to adjust the orbit. Let's see. Off. Let's see what we've got here. 52. Okay, let's not cut off then. Can we. Oh. What are we at now? We are. Oh, I can't flip that. 116. 68. Oh boy. Let me pitch back up here. I really screwed things up, didn't I? Yes, I did. Okay. Wah ha ha ha. Just 
scooch on in there. Oh, right. I see a seven. Seven. Oh, what was that? Oh, uh, what's it called? Burnout. Flash out. Let's launch out. Alright, well, I'd say we're in an orbit. Well, at least I can do that. Halfway. Oh, get that out of there. 91, 142. Alright, let's set up for prograde burn when we get to a periapsis. Actually, you know what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't want to screw with anything more than I have to. And a little closer. Okay. 142. Engines enabled? No, it's not. That would have been a tragedy, wouldn't it have been? Okay, let's go for a retrograde. Oh yeah, smoother now. Okay, pitch this in there. SES on. Let's do a very gentle burn. Bring this in. I got a little bit too greedy there. Let's try to. Ooh, oh, wow, very maneuverable. Let's try to get a, get her back. At least a hundred thousand there. I'd say that's good. Yeah. Okay. Whew. At least I know how to adjust orbits again. All right. When I just swing around to my apoapsis and get my periapsis up to a hundred. Thousand. Let's give it a go. Give it a little world there. I did not even see how long I was recording. Well, oh well. Oh, my orbit's a little, orbital plane's a little janked up there. Yeah, look at that. That's not. Uh, maybe that's something we need to learn how to correct. Whoa. Okay, pass that up. <laughs> uh, give me a prograde burn. Go in there. Oh, ha. Ah, just come on, come on. Like a surgeon, okay. Boost me up there. Six. Ah, that's fine. Ho! Ho, ho, ho. Merry Christmas, everybody. Uh, uh, I'll call that good for now. Alright, <laughs> let's just say that's a semicircular orbit. That's fine. I don't think even NASA can get this perfect. Come on. Um, now, figure out how do I want to do this plane... Oh, wow, that's a bright sun. Wow. Actually, I do the burn here. If I... Oh, no, take it off. Do a northerly burn. I believe I might be... Let's see, let's take a look. Northerly burn? Let's see what this does. Might be able to boost me up a little more, right? Perhaps not. Okay, let's not tempt fate here. <laughs> Let's not tempt that. That debris is going to be up there forever, isn't it? Maybe not. Let's see. Click it. Oh! Uh... Oh, okay. I thought I broke the game there for a second. Apparently, we can target, I guess, fly at a spent stage? Oh, no, purple, it's purple light. Um, that's forever in limbo. Let's see. Can I... Oh! Now, will this end my capsule flight? I guess there's only one way to find out. Let's end that flight. Yes, let's end that flight. No mission specs, tracking station. Aha! So, we can manually remove space debris. Nice, okay. Let's get back into our man capsule here. Whew, 100,000 kilometer orbit. First goal achieved. Now, how many times can you say that? Uh, now, one thing I haven't tried ever, really, is a precision landing. So, let's go a little above our head here and try precision landing. Where is KSP? Well, that looks interesting there. What is that? An island between a crater of water. Interesting. Maybe we have to... Uh, 
build a probe or fly a plane to investigate. Where's KSP? Now let's focus on... Aha! Alright, there's debris down there, so that must be KSP. Where are we? Can we do an alignment? I believe, actually, we might be able to uh, attempt uh, an approach. Let's uh, add a maneuver there. Let's do prograde. Oh, whoa, 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 okay. Broaden that a bit. Let's get it down. Is this down? Yes, that is. Ah, ha, ha. Look at me. Expert. Okay, it's going to slow down. Will that give me enough... Uh, larger. You know what? That just might bring us in. Alright, let's try it. Where are we? Two minutes from burn? Let's pitch us around to the node point here and lock us in. Oh boy, okay. Lock us into there. Alright. Thank God for watching some other Let's Plays. <laughs> and from whatever I can remember from all of my modded experiences. Alright, two minute burn. Let's fast forward a bit here. Okay, one minute. Oh, well. That went swimmingly, I guess. Approaching. Let's do it earlier. Yeah, that's good. Alright, let's do a burn. good to me so far and six seconds five seconds three two one I'd say that looks decent let's do a little small burst looks good to me okay map we have all this fuel but I guess we can use it for, um, I guess we can use this design to dock into stations, uh, like, uh, I, I mentioned earlier with, uh, uh, this Clampatron Jr. Okay, so, let's get rid of this stage. Actually, oh, let's try something. Space prograde. Ha 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 ha. Whoa, okay, ah, uh, ooh. The control's backwards? What's going on? I just don't have that great of fingers, do I? Which is why I don't play piano. Uh, let's do a spin. And... Japan. Not quite as exciting as I thought it would be. But let's take a screenshot of that. Why don't we? Okay. So. Thank God for no re-entry heat yet. Uh, and I can't pilot. Okay, let's turn SAS on so we're slower. If they bring re-entry heat within no actually i shouldn't say if when they bring the ranch heat uh in point 119 i am going to be royally and utterly screwed <laughs> this will be my first prison land landing if this goes well i guess that kind of proves that i can potentially land and re-enter safely but let's see what this angle looks like is that too steep or too shallow? No, I'd say... Actually, you know what? This kind of looks... This looks good. Okay. Let's, uh... Fast forward time. Cannot... Blah, 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 blah. Okay, yes, I know. Let's do some physical... Uh, don't show again. Thank you. Okay, whatever. Physical time warping. Jeb, still happy as ever. Jostling around in the seat. You know what? I can Also, you know... I can't wait for um, the improved animations. Hopefully, it look a little smoother than this. <laughs> right now, he looks like he's like in a pressure cooker, like popping around like a little piece of popcorn kernel, whatever. Um, oh, nice moonshot. Actually, you know, what? maybe we could have burned to the moon. Now that would have been a sight to see. Oh wait, ah, dang it! You know what? Let me get rid of that maneuver node. That's really bothering me. That <laughs> I was gaining delta v out of that. Oh, whoa, wait a second. Have we? Are we going to miss it? It's shrinking, but let's hope we don't miss it. Oh, boy. Okay. That's a service module. Yes, sir. 24 kilometers above the Earth. Or rather, Kerbin. 
Here comes the atmospheric sounds. Some debris over there. Ah, we're gonna just come shy of it. Yes, we... Ah, dang it. Okay. Shouldn't have made that extra burn, correction burn over there. But what's done is done, right? Let's bring her down a bit here. Bring her down to about... Oh, that's a mountain. Hold on. Let's launch that. Ooh, I was just looking at that. I'm just like, wait a second. Why is it so bumpy? Uh, that would have been tragic. I think a thousand kilometers might be the surface. Let's uh, work through that. Uh, there's you. That looks close. Um, uh, I it opens automatically, but we are. Oh, who? Oh wow, yeah. If I launched it at a thousand, we would have been just splattered into the ground. Let's uh, warp us in closer there. Oh man, yeah. We oh, we're not even. The surface must be a thousand right here. Yeah, we, we just landed on the Kerbin mountain range. Wow. Whew. Instincts, I guess. Instincts. Let's, oh, 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 oh. Last time I time warped, I kind of smashed into the ground. Might have been my poor design, but uh oh. Oh. Oh, oh, okay. I guess we're not going to roll. Let's try to pick ourselves up here. And, oh, don't. D uh, okay. Let's. Do this gingerly. Ah! Ha ha! So, I guess we can do a landing. Ha! Huh, great! Good! And, can I repack the jeep? I thought we should be able to repack. Oh, I have to be outside. I guess we can go on a little EVA. Oh, dang it! Damn! Damn, damn, damn. That's one of the things I wanted to do. EVA on orbit. Well, crap. Alright, I guess we can do EVA here now. Huh! So, first landing first successful landing, I guess in vanilla for me for a long time, and first recording of me doing it. So people who think, well friends who think I'm lying, in your face can land. And jetpack, jetpack, not jetpack, um, what's this called? Parachute, parachute, re-enabled, and what is that 62 kilometers away? Looks like Jeb has a lot of walking to do. Actually, put a jetpack on. And since this is, since this is an ink, wow, can I speak? Is since this is an incline, wow, how many S's can I say? Can I jump and jetpack? Oh, okay, yeah, maybe not. Oh, all right. And on that note, let's call this an episode. Thank you for watching. Leave a like. Do anything you want. Uh, and hopefully, I'll be back with episode two. Until then, see you later.